Sounds like Groot's got that toothy bastard under control. Back here and try to finish chewing through my ship, or else. What's up, muscles? Pissed about the array too? I am pondering our latest mission. I get you. Finally get a win, but no, gotta give our cash to Novacorn. I do not consider Seknoff 9 a successful heroic venture. It's successful because we got the units, not because it was heroic. Didn't you say the same thing after Satopia? That one was a bit higher on the heroism scale. Bank robberies are not heroic. Uh, yeah they are. Banks are evil. Rodent, will you have time to repair the broken refrigerator door? What? Like now? In the near future. I got a whole console to fix. And then I'm getting started on some weapons upgrades for the ship. I ain't got time for no big door. Tell me, Rodent, would you have harmed the llama creature if the tree had not removed it? You think? That thing's got it coming. I would prefer if you were framed. I would prefer not to have to remove your arm. What the? Why do you care about that Larma now? We have removed. Uh, penny for your thoughts? What is a penny? Uh, it's money. Like units? The saying means I'd pay to know what you're thinking. We must use our currency to pay the Nova Corps fine, or we risk. Drax. Just tell me what's up. I am realizing that I do not know as much as I thought I did. Our visit to Seknarf 9 was not what I expected. Because Lady Hellbender isn't a giant? She is definitely not. That is only part of it, Peter Quill. On our way to her fortress, I realize that many of my assumptions about this team have been incorrect as well. Really? The Assassin and the Rodent. Without them and the tree fighting nobly beside us, we would not be alive right now. I told you, they're not bad people just because they have a bad past. Life is... complicated, Drax. Things are never simple. On Katath, it was. I had a family that I cherished and a certainty about life that I no longer possess. I'm sure you'll find it again. Just give it some time. This thing looks so sinister. Hey, I don't go into your room and touch your stuff, Quill. What? You hacked my visor and added a scoreboard to it while I was sleeping. Eh, that was different. I improved it. Also, did anyone tell you that you snore? I thought Drax was bad, but wow. Quill, you should really get that checked. You sound like a torque. I don't snore that loud. <laughs> yeah, okay. So what is this thing anyway? It kind of looks like a metal face hugger. That is clearly a spinal control unit. Yes, right, of course, a, a spinal control thingy. Back on Half-World, Kree scientists used these to keep us super soldiers in line. Uh, they'd press a big fun red button and zap! Instant obedience. Holy crap. Rocket. How many of you super soldiers were there on Half-World? When the Kree started, a hundred, maybe. By the time I escaped, just me and Lila. She was the first one not to die from the control unit. And Lila is also a... What? A raccoon? Or not. 
a raccoon? You gotta understand. She was afraid of them, and the control unit made sure we stayed in line, that I stayed in line. Oh, that sounds... awful. I can't imagine. So, I did what I do best. I found a way to overload the control unit. When the Blueskins let us out of our cage, kaboom! <laughs> I blew a hole into the side of the lab. What we didn't know... What I didn't know was that the lab was protected by sentry bots. We got to the security fence and Lila covered me while I hacked the modulator frequency and uh, as soon as it opened, she pushed me through the door. I heard a die quill. Oh, the rocket. Doesn't matter now. Past is the past, right? And that thing, it's just a reminder. What exactly did the Kree do to you? They ripped me apart and rebuilt me over and over and over again until I became this half-finished thing they could mold and shape and control. Oh, Rocket, I had no idea. I mean, I knew the Kree Empire was desperate, but... Do you know what it's like to lose all control of your body? To be in constant pain, trapped inside yourself, and able to stop the horrible things you're doing? <laughs> that control unit made sure I did what I was supposed to do. Oh yeah, whether I wanted to or not. <laughs> A neat, furry little machine of death. Didn't take long to figure out I was better off not fighting it. Okay, then let's shoot this thing out the airlock. Have a little middle finger salute ceremony to the bastards who built it. Uh, yeah. I don't think I'm ready to let go of that part of me yet. Maybe one day. Are you 100% sure you want to keep it? What if it... Controls me? Eh, I decided a long time ago, Quill, that I would never let anyone control me again. As far as I'm concerned, this is just another useful piece of junk and a few bad memories. I'm... Sorry, you had to go through all that rocket. For real. Hey, Groot! Is the Chew Devil trying to chew on anything down there? I am Groot. Good. Keep it that way. Starting to think maybe it's just what it eats, you know? I am Groot. Yeah, the QZ would have been an open buffet for something that eats wires. I'm good. Oh, nice! You made a cute little pen. <laughs> you didn't mean to chew up the cons, did you? We could be halfway to nowhere by now, and only a few rotations away from getting that Clark and Nova tracker off. Bitter much? Yeah! I am! Going to nowhere without paying our fine would bring more trouble in the long- Gamora, did you find- <gasps> Are those... dolls? Yes. No. It doesn't matter. The Halosope's in the Teo system. Coordinates are in your console. So... Why'd you close the view screen? None of your business. Isn't it, though? Sounds like you're trying to hide something from us. Yes, I am. Hate to disappoint, but I saw everything. Didn't really peg you as a doll collector. And yes, I value my life. Peter, I'm not gonna kill you for asking about my collection. That's good, because last time... So what if I collect them? A lot of people have hobbies. Groot? Collects plants, rockets obsessed with bombs. Yeah, yeah, and Drax has a lot of really scary looking knives. See? Nothing out of the ordinary. I guess. You know, as a kid, I collected stuff too baseball cards, action figures. You think collections are childish? No, no, no. Uh, that's not what I meant. <laughs> I'm messing with you, Peter. I don't care what you think, I'd just rather keep my hobbies to myself. Time's ticking away, Peter. 
Okay, Corel, get ready to be impressed. Corel is probably monitoring this ship, waiting to see if we make the right choice. Looks like your girlfriend held up her end of the bargain, Quill. Do we know for sure it's her? Checking. Same designation as before. It's definitely Hallis Hope. Of my ship. Relax. Standard Nova Corps procedure. My ship's fine. Which part? Ask Quill. He's the one who keeps crashing it. All right. Let's pay that fine. Hmm. Good question. Hey, Gamora, you've been in a Nova Corps station. They got public restrooms. We have a toilet right here, Groot. Our bathroom is quite cramped for a being of his stature. He can bend. Really? Nothing at all? All right. Ready to pay our fine? I am Groot. Even Groot can see you're here for some blueberry pie. I'm going on the record that I don't want to be here, and that being here is a mistake. Want to bet on who can flip off the most officers before they catch us? Not in the mood. Okay. I thought you'd like that. You ever been to the Rock before? Yeah, looks like every other Nova Corps station. Any chance you know how to get around this place? You don't get around. You're either brought in or you stick to the reception desk. This reminds me of when I surrendered to the authorities. What was it like? Liberating. Okay, here we go. If they so much as scratched her pates, we get Novacore to reduce our fine. Good luck with that. It's gross negligee. Negligence. That's what I said. Where is everybody? Most Nova stations are heavily automated, all synchronized by the world mind. It is unsettling. Not like they had much choice after the war. M ship. Designation Milano. Move whoa, to holding whoa, space. Whoa. R7 Get back here with my ship! EL. Present validated ticket to kiosk. What? To ticket? Departure. Relax, Rocket. It's standard procedure. You keep saying that. This isn't exactly my first Nova Corps find. Yours either. First time I'm paying one. Okay, it's not supposed to be this empty. Is it a holiday? Space cops don't take holidays. Hello? I'm We're here to pay a fine? Looking for Centurion Corral? Door's locked. Well, we tried. Come on, let's go. We're not leaving. We'll go to them if we have to. Look. The door controls are on the other side if we can get you there. So what? Now I'm supposed to hack Nova Corps security? I mean, if you don't think you can. Cheap shot, Quill. We are discussing breaking into a Nova Corps facility. It ain't breaking in if no one's here.
That is precisely when one would break you. Perhaps this is a test. All right, there's an air duct in here. Could be a way in, Rocket. Could, sure. Or maybe it drops down into the hangar. Think you can squeeze through this vent? If you can get it open, I ain't that flexible. You're meant to be clearing our fine, not adding to it. We're not breaking in, breaking in. We're concerned citizens. We're not citizens of Xandar, or members of Novacor. Well, whatever. We've got to deal with that tracker so we can get back to guardianing the galaxy. All right, Drax, you know what to do. Absolutely not. Right, Gamora? Really? Groot, I don't like time this. to shine. We really do need to get that door open. Hey, I can crack it, but the panel's over there and we're stuck here. Have you checked the other rooms, Peter? Hey, Drax, get me a can of Power Star, would you? Shut your mouth! We're supposed to be leaving! What? <sighs> Groot says there's an air duct in the room with the controls. If there's one on this side, I may be able to get through. Nova's tech ain't that fancy. Don't expect me to hijack the world mind or anything, but I can handle some low-level security. There! One open air duct. Now we have damaged Novacore property. Eh, just a little. All right, Rocket. See if this vent leads into that other room. And be careful. You know, I still don't love this whole pay or fine plan, but I gotta say, messing with some Nova Core tech ain't a bad consolation prize. Huh. There's something screwy with the power grid. It's like they're on backup only. I'm patching you through. You know the drill. Tell me which circuits to switch. We can only reroute power with so many things at once. On it! Oh ho ho, clever, but I'll bet you didn't think of this. We'll find out. Prepare. Ow! Flark and Nova Scott! I am Groot. That's a door. The wrong door. Hey, it's a bathroom. Anybody got to go? The only place I want to go is out of here. Sure, I'll just hang out in the dark. Hey, I think I can set off the sprinklers from this thing. Does that help? Only if you want to get wet. Yeah, good point. Uh, Watch this. Yes. Anyone want a soda? Nah, I already checked for you. No faulty in spring water. Hey, that sort of worked. The blast door is going to need some extra juice. See if there's another power cut. We'll find out. Mark Peter! Sorry, sorry. I'm not much of an electrician. Presto! What else? You know, ta da! It is conspicuously silent. What are they doing? Scanning each other. Flark to find out why, though. They're acting bonkers. I am 
There. You hear that? Man, this place is big. What'd you expect? Someone out there? Perhaps the sentient space computer summoned all Nova Corps back to Zendar. Now this place brings back memories. Did you once serve with the Nova Corps, Peter Quill? What? No! But I had to stand in a lineup once, maybe twice. <clears throat> anyway, good to be on this side of the glass. What are you doing? I figured as long as we're here, I may as well try and dig up some juicy Nova secrets. Maybe they even got a bead on Gamora's blue or half. Not likely. What's that? Nothing. I formally declare my objection to trespassing in a Nova Corps facility. Noted. See? Drax doesn't want to pay the fine either. Hey, they're holding someone from Earth. A guy named Jack Flag. Ah! Do all you Terrans have ridiculous names? No, just the cool ones. I'm getting a real haunted mansion vibe from this place. And none of that screams run away to you? Ugh, elevator's out. But the shaft above looks open. We can use it to climb up there. You expect us to walk on that thing? It'll hold more than the five of us. Please don't fall, please don't fall. Oh, crap! <laughs> okay. Piece of cake. <laughs> oh, crap! <laughs> oh, you the look on both your faces. A bunch of babies. Oh, you were too. Are these... Centurion armor. Yup. Feel free to try one on, Quill. A true warrior requires no armor. You wouldn't fit in one anyway. For real? Can I try one? <laughs> if you want to get fried to a puddle of goo, each one is gene-coded by the world mine. Are you saying the world mine has the genetic code of every Nova Centurion? Yup. Word is, the bugs tried to use that against them in the war. But that's one supercomputer you can't hack. Believe me, I tried. This looks like the only way forward. Are you blind? I didn't sign up for getting chopped in two just so you could make your, your girlfriend proud. It is more likely that the door would repeatedly crush your tiny bones. What do you think one of these suits would go for on the black market? Some of these are empty. Your point? That some may be on duty. Yeah, maybe it's a good sign. Nothing about any of this is a good sign. <clears throat> this room is austerely presented. It must be a great honor to become a Centurion. To say the least, each Nova Prime is selected from among the Centurions. Perhaps the assassin can dart through while the door is open. Do I look like an idiot? Yeah. <laughs> oh, that was almost worth it. Maybe we can cut the power. Cut it from where? Do you see an access panel? Hear that? What? It's the death rattle of all the things we could be spending those units on. Perhaps the assassin can dart through while the door is open. Do I look like an idiot? You're not that fast, Peter. <laughs> Let him try. This is great. Maybe we can cut the power. Ah, no wonder the door is all jorked out. The rotor won't stop spinning. So, were you one of them on or whatever? All right, let's hope that holds. How come this one gets its own room? Looks like a workshop. You know, I hear they anodize these things with some kind of Zendarian smart metal. Subcutaneous emitter is busted. Hmm. Whatever that is. That means something to you? Maybe. Means it can't report back to the world mine. That checks out with what I saw in the lobby. I bet I could take a Centurion. I went one-on-one -on -one with a Millennium, you know. More nothing! There's gotta be an explanation. 
The house hope is a capital ship. Maybe they're all there for some reason. Or maybe this whole place is contaminated with Vormerian pox. I am experiencing a mild itching sensation. Yeah, and I got a real pain in my ass. Rocket, do your magic. No. What? I said no. When are you gonna come to your senses, Quill? I am Groot. And then what? He's gonna drag us halfway through this station if we let him. Okay. We try one more room. And if we still haven't found anything, we leave. Deal? Fine. One more room. Not two. One. Flarked. We ain't going back that way. I thought the Nova Corps had more ships. I heard they got uh, staffing issues. From who? People. In places with uh, other people. Peter Quill. I found this. Sector 1, check in. Sector 1, sweep complete. 75% acceptance rate. It is as she promised. Have faith. Promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. With faith. Well, the good news is we're not alone. There's lots of chatter. Tell them I want my ship back. My ship. I sense there's a butt. But it sounds like they're searching for something or someone. Could explain why no one's around. Well, who gives a flark? Tell them to get their golden butts up here. The promise will be made real. Uh, hey there. Is this thing on? We're, uh, we're looking for Centurion Corel. Who is we? We're the Guardians of the Galaxy. We were supposed to meet Centurion Corel to pay a fine. Hello, Guardians of the Galaxy. I would be more than happy to assist you today. Where are you now? We're, uh, in some sort of monitoring station. Understood. Stay where you are. We will come to you. Well, what did they say? They're coming to us. Huh. It's about Flark and time. Where's Centurion Corel? Have faith. She is not with us at this time. Flarked. We ain't going back that way. I thought the Nova Corps had more ships. I heard they got, uh, staffing issues. From who? People. In places with, uh, other people. Peter Quill. I found this. Sector 1, check in. Sector 1, sweep complete. 75% acceptance rate. It is as she promised. Have faith. Promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. With faith. Well, the good news is we're not alone. There's lots of chatter. Tell them I want my ship back. My ship. I sense there's a butt. But it sounds like they're searching for something or someone. Could explain why no one's around. Well, who gives a flark? Tell them to get their golden butts up here. The promise will be made real. Proceed to Sector 7. With faith. Sector 3, check in. Sweep of Sector 3 in progress. There has been some uh, resistance to the promise. 
Permission to initiate cleansing procedure. Cleansing procedure authorized. Faith be with you. Let's keep looking. Or we could focus on getting off this Vercactus space station. The door's flark, remember? There's ways to unflark things, Gamora. Believe me. Bombs don't count. What about that? Where do you think that goes? Down. Good enough for me. Hey, what happened to one more room? You said the door's busted. I'm sure it's just a little further. You ain't sure as scut. I'm mostly sure. We found something, didn't we? So why the flark, then you sp There they are. Something's not right. Oh, Flark. Dishonor Flark! I am Groot. <sighs> this is a mutiny. It was an execution. I ain't never seen cops kill each other. We've got to play this smart until we know what's going on. And which side survived? All right. Everyone stay low and follow me. There's something off about them. Look! They're Flark and glowing. Seems a safe bet these are the bad guys. We need a plan. We should seize the element of surprise. Are we- Go! Let him have it! You disgrace the uniform you wear! Let's just hope none has centurion armor! Why did we find them here? I ain't interested in the flark and mystery! Put them through! At least we got the jump on them! Their carelessness will be their downfall! Lob it out of big guy! Big guy, 12 o'clock! Current time is irrelevant. Bear, kill, now! Ah! 